Hello and welcome to another exciting episode of the Queensland Premier Rugby Wrap. The only place to find all the latest results and highlights from the last round of Queensland Premier Rugby. This week we'll take a look back at all the semi-final action before we preview the preliminary final. University booked their place in the 2014 Premier Rugby Grand Final with a three-point win in the major semi-final over Sunnybank while Jeeps ended Brothers' season with an eight-point victory in the minor semi. Brothers were first to put points on the board through the boot of Sam Green before his opposite James Tuttle levelled the scores. Jeeps then asserted their physical presence on the match with back-to-back -back tries. Fred Burke's try off the back of a rolling maul was followed soon after by a terrific carry and offload by Chris Kuradrani to set Samu Karevi up for Jeeps' second try of the afternoon. Down 18-3 and needing to score the next points to stay alive, the Brethren did exactly that as Ben Suisala barged his way over the line. Sam Green added a further three points with this easy penalty attempt, but Jeeps would have the last laugh as Tuttle knocked over another penalty and sealed the final score. The Masashi High Performer Award for the minor semi went to Marco Kotze, who was strong across the field all day for the Gallopers in their win. Congratulations Marco on a well-deserved Masashi prize pack. Uni flew out of the gates early in their clash with the Dragons as Ben Cullen dived over in the left-hand corner before Tim Buchanan did the same on the right-hand side. After defending several phases inside their own half, the Dragons scored their first try of the night against the run of play through some smart work from Ben Tapwai over the top of a weak university clean-out. Henry Tafu and Tom Pincus then traded penalties for the two teams. Matthew Fionardi went from hero to zero in a matter of minutes as he bumped Harry Parker to cross in the right-hand corner before gifting Parker with a try of his own following this drop ball under a high Will Thompson box kick. With just minutes remaining, Sunnybank remained a chance thanks to this effort from Junior Lalawifi, but the Red Heavies held on and progressed straight through to Sunday week's grand final. Connor Mitchell was the Masashi high performer for the Red Heavies as he remained a persistent force at the breakdown all afternoon and was integral in guiding the minor premiers straight through to the grand final. Congrats Connor, enjoy that Masashi prize pack. The results from last Sunday means Jeeps and Sunnybank will go toe to toe in this Sunday's preliminary final at Ballymore kicking off at 3.05pm. The winner will progress to face University in the 2014 Premier Rugby Grand Final. If you can't make it to Ballymore, make sure you check out the live stream at redsrugby.com.au. Make sure you check out the Queensland Premier Rugby Weekly this Thursday afternoon to preview all the preliminary finals action. And get down to Ballymore on Saturday and Sunday to check out the stars of tomorrow, today.